Hello, everybody, and welcome to this episode of The Big Story. What's this episode's big story? The Fedora Project releases Fedora 10. Fedora 10 features many improvements over Fedora 9. Several features are geared directly towards developers, and some are geared directly towards the enterprise. Things such as a centralized way to manage all of your virtual machines through their application called Vert Manager. You can sit at one workstation and connect to all of your Fedora systems and manage all of the Zen systems that are loaded onto those boxes. That's a great feature for the enterprise. Other things such as improved remote desktop is also a great enterprise feature for IT support and the security auditing features that have been improved in Fedora 10 are also extremely important for large enterprises. There have been improvements to printing and to audio support as well. Better audio hardware support, um, the audio system will wake up less, which that's basically a term that means it won't pull as much power from your, to your sound card, so you get better battery life on a laptop. <clears throat> a great feature. Also, the printing support's been improved with better printing hardware, better printer management tools, a better GUI to manage all of those kinds of things. Very nice for home users, as well as an improved installer. But the feature that I really like the most is a feature that I've kind of railed on Fedora for for the last couple of releases, and that's the artwork. This release of Fedora features the solar theme, and I really think the art team for Fedora has outdone themselves with this release. It features a very cool kind of spacey look to it. It's also very elegant. They've done everything from it makes the installer process look better. It's a very it's a very good, very very clean looking installer. They've made the boot process look better, and they've even made the GNOME login screen look incredible. And then also the new theme details I think look quite good at first during the development phase I was a little concerned but now I think the title bars and things like that look quite clean and very professional. I think overall Fedora 10 is going to be a great release. It's got a lot of great stability enhancing features but also some cutting edge features on top of a great GUI. I think Fedora, Fedora 10 might just be what Fedora 6 was for a lot of us. A great release. <laughs>